Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm showing you guys my high waisted shorts collection. So the first set are Levi's and this one I bought for about $20 on sale and ended up really really loving them. I wear them all the time. They are my favorite. This next pair of Levi's I got from a flea market and I purchased them mainly because of this gray color. I was really into gray at one point of my life. And then these are by Vibrant MIU and if you guys watch my high waisted jeans collection, you guys know I like Vibrant MIU because they have the this amazing material that like conforms to your butt. And these are the black pair. I purchased them on loveculture.com a while ago, so they are probably not available, but you could probably find them everywhere. Um, these are H&M shorts, and they're my most recent purchases of high-waisted shorts, and they are pretty rough and not very stretchy, and they kind of just look like someone hacked off their legs, but um, I kind of still like that look, and I don't mind that they're not that stretchy, so... These next ones are from PacSun and they are the mom shorts and they were probably some of my first high waisted shorts purchases um, mainly because of this one which is a beautiful bright blue and they are soft and stretchy and they go up pretty high. They don't show off your butt cheek which was a major thing that I wanted. This is also another pair of PacSun shorts. It is called the Hot Shorts and these are a little more hoochie and they have these side slits which is basically why I got them but um, I don't need them. These next ones are from Urban Outfitters by Kimchi Blue I believe and I purchased them mainly because of Taylor Swift and then these are also from Urban Outfitters and I got them on sale for about $10 and uh, I ended up really really loving them because of their dolphin hems and the whole sailor button front look. So the rest of the shorts are all from Forever 21. Um, this one I purchased because of the color and the four buttons that do show in the front. I kind of thought that was nice and unique. And then these are probably some of my favorite high-waisted shorts by far. They are super stretchy. They flatter your butt like no other. And they are very similar to higher-end shorts like the PacSun ones or the American Apparel ones for much cheaper. And they are pretty good quality. So if you can still find these shorts, I would snag them up because I definitely did uh, buy multiple pairs of each color. And then these shorts are some older pair of shorts from Forever 21 that I purchased. Um, first, I love this color. It's kind of unique and so I still wear a lot. But my problem is that they don't have front pockets. I got over that quickly but still. So as you can tell by now, if I like something, I buy it in multiple colors. And here are the light wash pair. I'm more of a medium to dark uh, denim wash girl but sometimes you gotta have your light wash. So these next shorts are my only deconstructed high-waisted shorts, um, but I really love the way they are deconstructed and the way they really uh, give a chill vibe to any outfit. This wash is to die for, I swear. And then these next ones are really similar to the Vibrant MIU ones, which is kind of the reason I bought them, but I should have not bought them for that reason. But I still bought them. Um, I love that they're super stretchy and form-fitting. And yeah, you can't go wrong with that. These next one are some of my first high-waisted shorts purchases from Forever 21. And they came cuffed. I had to uncuff them because they were a bit too hoochie for me. But I love that they were lightweight, um, you know, sufficiently stretchy and not too tight on my body. Then these ones I purchased a while ago as well. And they come with a four-button closure, which caused me to not wear them as much because of the effort that they require just to put them on and take them off. Now they are definitely one of my least worn pairs. And then these ones I purchased because of the bright blue color which is similar to the PacSun Mom Short ones. But they shrunk in the wash and now they're a little too snug so I don't wear them as often. And this pair I purchased because it was $10 and I couldn't walk out of the store without buying it. I know, problem. So these are non-blue jean high-waisted shorts. This is one of the shorts that I've been wearing non-stop this summer because it's white, it's not cuffed, and it is super comfortable. I bought it for about $12. And then this pair of pink shorts, I bought it because it was pink. Um, it's also really comfortable and about $12 as well. This is the same style as the pink one but in red, and I just love a good pair of red bottoms. And then these are my only printed high-waisted shorts in this beautiful floral that I got on sale. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed my high-waisted shorts collection. And please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.